بالله من الشيطان الرجيم. Say, describe my tune as emotion. It's mixed with joy. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. You know, uh, uh, anguish, a bit of sadness, but a bit of romance, like it, all of it. Alif Lam. Honestly, it's completely changed my relationship with the Quran and how I feel when I recite it out loud. It's so important to have a beautiful tune, um, you know, and also our Prophet, peace be upon him, um, recognized that and pushed for uh, us to beautify the recitation of the Quran. thought it was so haram that a woman would recite the Quran where men could hear her. And Sheikh Muhib was like, Maryam, don't you know that Islamic history is filled with women reciters? Don't you know that our legacy is women reciting the Quran? Don't you know how many in our history, how many women have taught, the, ha, taught men the Quran? This is our history. This is Islamic legacy, women reciters. I launched um, the hashtag female reciters campaign to raise awareness of the rich public soundscape where women recite the divine text of the Quran. Not a lot of women want to recite Quran because maybe they might not be professional reciters, they might not um, feel, they might feel shy, they might not feel confident. I want it to be just like a safe space for anyone to, to recite whether they're a beginner or just learning or an expert so it's like a safe space for everyone. غير المغضوب عليهم